so we're leaving Davao and we're headed to uh, Valencia we'll be in Valencia uh, God willing for a couple of days and then we're gonna go to Cagayan de Oro and we'll be in Cag Cag Cagayan de Oro we'll be there for a few days and then we'll be getting on a boat God willing to uh, uh, Bohol or Peng Lao. So we're moving around a little bit now. We've been here in Davao for a week. We were blessed to stay um, at a pastor's house. Really nice place and a nice community here um, in Davao. We got to see some really cool things. And so now we're at the bus terminal. In uh, typical fashion, we have no idea when the buses are leaving or which bus we need to take to get to where we're going. There's no advanced tickets or anything, so we think we found a bus. There's two buses here, I think, that are going where we want to go. Uh, the one bus is leaving here pretty quick. I shouldn't say pretty quick, probably in an hour or so, but the bus doesn't have a bathroom. There's another bus I think they can get us to where we want to go. Uh, it doesn't leave for a you know maybe even a couple of hours but it has a bathroom on it so i think it's better to better not to risk it and just wait the extra time and get on a bus that has a bathroom now, these other buses stop you know and let you know like after an hour and a half or two hours or something let you use the bathroom but that doesn't do you much much good like if you're you know hurting or in pain and you gotta you gotta go sometimes it just comes so but yeah, this is the bus terminal. bus terminal.
smooth ride a little bit hilly a little bit windy but uh it was a good ride and the driver was really nice in the bus and he left us off right in front of our hotel so that saved us you know the cost of a taxi ride to get from the bus terminal to the hotel so the only problem is as soon as, as soon as the bus stopped the sky opened up and just started dumping so that's our hotel right there we're able to come over here and jump underneath this roof for a little bit, hoping the rain will slow down enough that we can get over to our hotel. But uh, yeah, so far smooth sailing. strange going on in this town. I booked the hotel on Agoda and um, we show up at the hotel. I have a picture of the hotel. I saved everything and they said, oh, sorry sir, Agoda must have made a mistake. Your, hotel, your booking is at this other hotel. So we come to this other hotel. I haven't seen what it looks like yet, but the outside is horrible. The uh, the tricycle driver gives us a ride to the hotel and we asked him specifically before we got on the tricycle how much it cost. We actually asked the lady at the hotel before we, like how much does the uh, tricycle cost? She said it was 10 pesos per person to go from the other hotel to this hotel. So that'd be 20 pesos. 
So we got before we got in, we asked him how much. He says, "Oh, it's up to you. You can give me whatever you want." Okay. So we get in. He brings us down here. We give him double the amount. We give him 50 pesos, and then he says, "No, you have to pay for the bags." So it just puts you in just a horrible, just a horrible mood. But you know, it's the Philippines, and everything uh, functions a little bit differently here. Things aren't on the up and up, so I'm going to make sure I include him and his uh, tricycle on the video. Not that it means anything, but at least put him on display for the deceitful person that he is. So let's go in here and see how bad this hotel is. As expected, this isn't the room that I paid for. Not the hotel that I paid for, but I have to make it do. There's nothing else I can do about it because the other place they said, well, if you try to cancel it on Agoda and and get a refund, um, then we can we can accommodate you here, but only for one night. You know? So it's unfortunate, but. No sense in getting upset about it. You know, this is the uh, it's what we're dealing with. I'm just gonna have to make it work. You know, it's could always be worse. You know, it could always be worse. I'm not gonna get in a bad mood about it. I just see uh, put a complaint in on a go to, and that's about all I could do. It's the first time this has happened. The other times I've used a go to everything's been fine so but yeah, we'll, we'll get through it um, at least we made it here safe and you know, it looks relatively secure so uh, put our stuff down go get something to eat to be on camera.